Inability to resolve any issue without resorting to violence means in the state is a concern, says Dr. Narim Sanatomba. Three Congress MLAs from Jharkhand arrested with huge amount of cash from Kolkata suspended. India's weightlifting success at Commonwealth Games continues with Jeremy Lal Renunga's gold medal. And India records a total of 19,673 fresh COVID cases along with 39 fatalities due to the infection in the past 24 hours. Good evening, you're watching Pony TV Primetime English News at 6.30. I'm Lakshmi Bhai Thangzam. Now the news in details. Associate Professor of Manipur Department, Manipur University, Dr. Narem Sanatomba, has expressed concern over inability to resolve any issue without resorting to violence means in the state of Manipur. He met the state at the National Convention on Mite Meek, organized by Mite Irol Iyek, Loina Silol Apunbalup, Milal at the GM Hall today. The convention was moderated by Milal advisor Marang Thiem Naudalen Komba. Speaking on the occasion, Dr. Naurem Sanatomba stated Milal had to burn down the central library to pursue its demand for promotion of Mite Meek script. Despite having adopted and then studied till master's level in university, differences still persist. Such differences in opinion only delay the progressive growth of the language. Only few books of university have been rewritten into Mithi Mayak. Majority are still written in Bengali. He urged to all concerned to resolve any differences in regards to the language and the script to further take them to new heights. Namsunga Mudabada, Angang Muin and Namgadava Emugis <laughs> Hite, Namgadava, Port Oyaga di Pava, Mingunda Sinning, Brazil Sinning, but Poktava, Aduna Quena Milana, Que Mayaki Tans, which is sent over State Committee, Tegi, Toxay Maduna, Aquisu, Mamangi, and with a quay paper, the E. Gibani, Masai, Mayak, Laila, Su, Pangabagi Matangse, Maduna, Aquisu, Hose, Covid Nakitan, and Uto. Speaking at the event, Milal Secretary in Charge L. Nomailembi Lema stated that Mitemeyek was implemented on May 18, 2005 as per the government's order in response to Milal's demand. It is then begun teaching at schools in 2006. Milal had organized numerous hesitations demanding implementation of Mitemeyek, during which 500 of its members were detained by police. Some of them have even been imprisoned and 22 of them charged with NSA. Therefore, anyone who tries to restrain in promoting Mite Meek will be dead with iron hand. Fishers from the surrounding areas of Loktak Lake today staged a sit-in protest at Sandra in Bisnupur district demanding reconsideration of the order issued by the Loktak Development Authority to remove biomasses, huts and homestays from the lake. O Sarojini, one of the demonstrators, claimed that they depend on the income generated from services provided to tourists visiting the lake to support themselves. According to Radesana, asking them not to access the lake is unfair because locals and fishermen depend on it for survival, so they ought to be provided a means for livelihood. Residents of Kiam Wangmataba, Kiam Makalekai and Moising have repaired a 400 meter long road from National Highway No. 102 at Taubal Tangzing, Tangzing Chingkong leading to FCI Godown Taubal with their own resources. TH Colin from Kiam Makalekai stated that although this road is crucial for residents of the three neighborhoods, the quality of the road worsened due to the passage of heavy vehicles. He further said, they have requested department concerned regarding the deplorable conditions of the road, but no one has taken seriously. As a result, villagers of the Haibong Lera Club, Kiam Welfare Club, and Kiam Wangmataba Club met a contribution and temporarily repaired the road. He appealed the government and the minister concerned to rebuild the road properly at the easier possible. 
ไปชากันเป็นตัวรักก็ยังมีเสียงบางอย่างที่มันต้องมีจินตนาการอย่างเดียวกันว่าโรลล์นั้นสิ่งบ้าเจสิบินั้นสิ่งบ้าคุณไ
Irfan Ansari, a lawmaker from Jamtara, informed him that he had been promised the position of health minister in the BZP's incoming administration in addition to rupees 10 crore for its MLA. Indian Police Service Officer from Tamil Nadu Kedar, Sanjay Arora, will succeed Rajesh Astana as Police Commissioner of Delhi. He will leave his current post of Director General in the Tibetan Border Police, ITBP, to join on tomorrow. According to the Union Home Ministry, he may serve the post to, until his retirement on July 31, 2025, or until further orders. Director General of Sasastra Sima Bal SL Thousand will head the ITBP as additional charge for now. After Rakesh Astana, who was appointed in July 2021, and Ajay Raj Sarma, who was appointed in 1999, Sanjay Arora is only the third officer from outside the Arunachal Pradesh, Goa, Mizoram, and Union Territory, AGMUT, together to be brought in to head the National Capital's police force. One Laskar e Taiba LET terrorist was killed in an encounter with security forces in Baramulla district of Jammu and Kashmir on Sunday. The terrorist was identified as Irsad Ahmad Bhad, a resident of Baramulla's Patan. On the basis of information about the presence of terrorists at Binar area, Baramulla district, the security forces launched a cordon and search operation on Saturday evening. However, the search operation turned into an encounter after the terrorists opened fire at the security forces, which retaliated and in exchange of firing, the terrorist was killed. The police have recovered 01 AK rifle, two magazines and 30 rounds. Enforcement Directorate ED officers have detained Chief Sena MP Sanjay Raut after a day-long raid and questioning at his Mumbai's residence in connection with the Patrachal land scam case. The Chief Sena leader was summoned by the prop agency in connection with the redevelopment of a child in Mumbai and related transactions involving his wife and close associates on July 27 after he skipped an earlier summon citing the ongoing parliament session in Delhi. At 7 a.m., the prop agency team, accompanied by CISF officers, reached Sanjay Raut's home in Bandup in eastern suburbs of Mumbai and began the searches. India's weightlifting success at the 2022 Commonwealth Games continued with Jeremy Lalrenunga's gold medal in the men's 67 kg category. India now has two gold medals in the competition following yesterday's victory by S lifter Mirabai Chanu. Jeremy created a new Commonwealth Games record in the snatch event by picking up 140 kg. He lifted a total of 160 kg in the clean and jerk segment to finish with a grand total of 300 kg, setting a new CWZ record. The 19-year-old from Aizwal in Mizoram had won the gold in the 62 kz event at the 2018 Youth Olympic Games and also won a gold medal in the 67 kz category in the Commonwealth Championships last year. This was India's fifth medal from the weightlifting arena with Mumbai Mirabai Chanu gold, Sanket Sagar sil silver, Bidarani Devi silver and Guru Raj Pujari bronze earning podium finishes yesterday. India recorded a total of 19,673 fresh COVID cases along with 39 fatalities due to the infection in the past 24 hours, bringing the country's overall COVID tally to 4 crore 40 lakh 19,811. According to the data shared by the Union Health Ministry, 19,336 have been registered in the last 24 hours in India. The total death toll in India stands at 5,26,357. Of the 39 deaths reported in the last 24 hours in the country, seven were from West Bengal, four from Maharashtra, three from Delhi, two each from Chhattisgarh, Gujarat, Haryana, Himachal Pradesh, Jammu and Kashmir, Kerala, Madhya Pradesh, Punjab and Uttar Pradesh, and one each from Assam, Goa, Karnataka, Nagaland, Sikkim, Tripura and Uttar Khan. Taking the Delhi positivity rate at 4.96%, the total active cases stands at 1,43,676 in the country. The recovery rate is recorded at 98.48% as per the data. According to the Health Ministry, 204.25 crore doses of COVID-19 vaccine have been administered in the country so far under the nationwide vaccination drive. Before we end, let's take a look at the top news headlines again.
Inability to resolve any issue without resorting to violent means in the state is a concern, says Dr. Narem Sanatomba. Three Congress MLAs from Jharkhand arrested with huge amount of cash from Kolkata suspended. India's weightlifting success at Commonwealth Games continues with Jeremy Lalrinunga's gold medal. And India records a total of 19,673 fresh COVID cases along with 39 fatalities due to the infection in the past 24 hours. Thank you for watching Pony TV. For more updates, keep watching Pony TV and stay tuned.